In the name of the princess and you fucking zip up. Oh, oh it worked. Thanks, Oz. <laughs> What's up guys, it's Mimi. I'm here today for another cosplay review. This time I bought another cosplay from Doki Doki and it's Fischl from Genshin Impact. So I bought the SR version and what that means is the superior rare quality. There's three different types of costumes you can buy depending on the quality. There's R, SR and SSR. The SSR will have the best quality possible for fabrics and the R will be the lowest one. So the SR that I bought for Fischl is between the both of them, but they didn't do any SSR version of Fischl. They did an R version and SR version. So I got that one. So quick story about Doki Doki. They don't actually make their costumes. A lot of people think they do because they don't really credit the artist of where they bought it from. They buy it off companies and resell them to people internationally. So yeah, I just received it I think two weeks ago and we're in September. It was supposed to be in April. Yep, that was uh, pretty long. Okay, so I have the costumes right here. Um, I guess I'll start with the most important part, the dress. It's a really, really pretty dress. I honestly am impressed with the quality. The only thing I really don't like is this mesh here. Like this is really not see-through and thank god my skin color is about the same color so it won't show. Um, but it kind of sucks for people who have darker color that like you can't really order a cosplay like this. I feel like they should have gone with a more see-through fabric uh, so it would be easier to match the skin tone of anyone that would buy it. Uh, so yeah, so this part is right like all around here, goes up to here, and there's another layer of black over it. I think I'm going to remove the skin mesh under it because everything is just sewn over it. I feel like it would look more of the character if I did that uh, because I don't mind showing a little skin. <laughs> oh, same for the back here. The back is just really, the whole thing is the mesh fat skin fabric and there's the wings that come out of it. So the base fabric, the black one, is all shiny. I don't know if you can see it, uh, if it picks up on camera, but it's all shiny. Everything is embroidered here, so it must have took a lot of time to make that costume, so I understand why it took so long. There's a collar up here. This is really freaking itchy, by the way. I tried it on because I was like too excited when I got it so I tried it and oh my god this is really itchy I'm gonna have to like add something inside so it doesn't itch as much but damn that's annoying the back is a whole zipper like the electro newies So this is the inside, as you can see, like the whole thing inside of it. It's just a mesh skin fabric that's not exactly see-through. I'm just gonna zip this back up. The zip is stuck. On some parts of the fabric, it's all printed. As you can see, the details here, that's all a print. Um, but I, I honestly can't imagine how they would have done it any other way to print it on. And this fabric is the same shiny uh, black one that we had on f at the front. And, <laughs> and for the pants here, um, it's actually shorts under it, but it's all together. Like you have, when you put it on, you put the shorts on and the dress together. Like it's all sewn together. It's one piece. And one of them has the leg uh, sewed directly to it. It's a stretchy velvet for this part. The rest of the costume isn't really stretchy, so make sure you check your measurements. I checked mine. I was a bit scared it would be a bit tight because uh, I took a small and it fits well, but I, I don't have a much loose on it. So yeah, make sure you check the measures on the website. But that's the part of the dress. <laughs> that's the dress. That's one part that goes over her arm. It's made with the same uh, sparkly fabric, uh, but this time in purple. 
and it's also printed over there's ruffles this is the same itchy fabric that's on the collar uh, there's an elastic in it so you can fit it up your arm in it um, I'm pretty sure if it's really too tight you could just sew another one in it like it's pretty much a basic stitch we have a glove with hair oopsie the glove is the same fabric as the mesh that's on the leg for one of her legs that is directly sewn on the dress. This is also stretchy a bit. And there's the purple, the light purple and the black on the inside. There's some prints on it. And it's a bit see-through. You don't really see, but it's, it is a bit see-through. Can you see my face? <laughs> that one is the, the exact same, but on the other arm, she just has it like here on her finger. Like this and there's the other stocking that goes uh, on her other leg so this one also has an elastic that you put around your leg so it stays up and it has lace on top and it's the same mesh fabric as the arms and the other legs there's some really nice details all around it with those metal thingies getting getting also comes with the eye patch it's still the same uh, sparkly fabric uh, that's not stretchy and it has the rose printed on it. has an elastic to tie it around your, your head. Why is it this big? Hello, I'm pirate. <laughs> Comes with transparent straps and I'm not sure where to put these. But yay! Useful? What the hell is this? Oh! First time you see this, they give underwear with your costume. And there's a shit ton of accessory. Like, I, I don't even know where all of these go. Like, this is gonna be a challenge to assemble. Comes with the vision. You can even put batteries in it so it lights up. Plus side here, minus side here. Didn't work. We'll try this. So I switched the battery side. <gasps> it lights up! Yay! You can kind of see the wires. It looks like um, those fairy lights that are inside. You can kind of see them through. Yay! Yay! And it comes with just a pin inside that you tie on it. So these are parts that goes into her hair. I'm afraid it's gonna break because it's really thin. It's It feels like it's just felt and one side has sparkles on it and the other side has little clips like this. There's wings. Maybe those goes on her boots. It's the same fabric with the little boop boop boop. This part here goes over her chest here, I think all embroidered with some sparkles. You can kind of see the edge of it that it's white because the back is white. Oh no, something broke. I think those go into her hair and it had black clips in the back and this one just fell off. Ooh, okay, this is pretty. This goes on her neck here. The bow, honestly, the fabric is really thin but it's really shiny I'm not sure what this type of material is I think it's 3d printed it seems really sturdy oh but there's glue on the back so I guess that part fell off too and there's just a gem in the middle needs more sturdiness there's some two bows that goes in her hair how many how many things goes into her hair same thing clips in the back there's a tube of glue so I can stick my stuff back on it's like they knew it might fall off <laughs> all of the other pieces that go on the costume is really just like a patch that was embroidered on and it has a safety pin in the back Nora wants to come in. Yes, to her. Hello. 
There's these two ones also that look 3D printed. The gem aren't really straight in the middle. <laughs> so that's all the parts for the costume. Wait, no. I had the wig. This one was also bought from their website. The main part of it, here. It's really long and it's really thick. This is gonna be a hassle to always brush out. <laughs> it has two ties here on each side. So it comes with two small ponytails. I'm gonna put on everything. <laughs> In the name of the princess and you fucking zip up. Oh, oh it worked. Thanks Oz. Two hours later. Hello again. It's like half an hour later because there are so many pieces on this costume. No, don't eat my underwear that I did not wear. I had problems putting the zipper all the way up. Get someone to help you with this because there's a lot of pieces that go on the back. On the hair, there's just so many details. Why does she have so much stuff on her hair? And there's just this one side that has this bat wing that I was like, what? I had to go on the game to see the reference for the character to know which part goes where. But yeah, here's me in the costume. So this is pretty much overall the costume. The things I dislike about it is how every small piece is just a safety pin that you have to put on. Um, one of the thing is that the safety pin really isn't pointy enough. So sometimes you have to force your way into the fabric and you don't want to do that. So I'm probably just going to change all the safety pins to some pointier ones so I don't ruin the fabric. Some of them had a really weird orientation and it makes it hard to put it on because the safety pin is vertically as well. Uh, this keeps falling off. Overall, I really love the costume. Like there's just so many attention to detail. I could never sew anything like it. I'm just gonna change a bunch of accessories though, but the dress is probably gonna stay the same. It's really just the accessories and things that I'm gonna modify so it fits better. Um, how I see official like I'm probably gonna change the patches here but overall like I think I'm gonna give it like a 9 out of 10 like I'm so happy with it I can't wait to like do the bow and do a photo shoot with this with all my friends because we're a huge gang that bought cosplays from <laughs> Genshin Impact so yeah it's gonna be so fun before I forget the French word of the day <laughs> I have a little crow <laughs> Ain't he cute? He's so cute! So, <laughs> the French word of the day today is Corbeau. Corbeau. Corbeau means crow! Yay! Hope you guys enjoyed this. I also bought the cosplay of Ningguan from Genshin Impact, also from Doki Doki. So I'm also going to review that one. And I have another one coming. <laughs> in the mail probably in October we don't know we never know today so yeah um, but my next goal that I really would like to buy is Kokomi so here's the link down in the description to my coffee if you want to help me get to the goal um, I'm also gonna do a review of that one so yeah link is down below <laughs> everything is pretty much clips or pin or um what is it safety pins 